Hello, my fellow readers. Today, we will be reading Sammy the Seal by Sid Hoff. Sid Hoff is also the author of Danny the Dinosaur. Sammy the Seal Stories and Pictures by Sid Hoff It was feeding time at the zoo. All the animals were getting their food. The lions ate their meat. The elephants ate their hay. The monkeys ate their bananas. The bears ate their honey. Then it was time for the seals to be fed. Mr. Johnson took them fish. Hooray for fish, said the seals. They jumped in the water. Soon the basket was empty. That's all there is, said Mr. Johnson. There is no more. Thank you for the fish, said the seals. They were good. The seals were happy. But one little seal was not happy. He sat by himself. He looked sad. What is wrong, Sammy? said Mr. Johnson. I want to know what it's like outside the zoo, said the little seal. I want to go out and look around. All right, Sammy, said Mr. Johnson. You have been a good seal. You may go out and see. Goodbye, Sammy, said the other seals. Have a good time. Goodbye. Where are you going? said the zebra. I am going out, said Sammy. Have fun, said the hippo. Come back soon, said the giraffe. Sammy walked and walked and walked. He did not know what to look for. First, that seal must be from out of town, said a man. Sammy looked at everything. What street is this? said a man. I am a stranger here myself, said Sammy. I guess it's feeding time here too, said Sammy. That's a lovely fur coat, said a lady. Where did you get it? I was born with it, said Sammy. I wish I could find some water. I'm hot. I want to go swimming, said Sammy. I'm sorry, but there's no room for you in this puddle, said the birds. And there's no room for you here, said the goldfish. Keep out, said the policeman. You cannot swim in here. Ah, here's a place, said Sammy. Who is in my bathtub, said someone. I'm sorry, said Sammy. He left at once. Some children were standing in a line. Sammy got in line too. What are we waiting for? asked Sammy. School! What do you think? said a boy. That will be fun. I will come too. The teacher was not looking. Sammy sat down. The children made words with blocks. Sammy wished he could spell. All right, children, now we all sing a song, said the teacher. The children had good voices. That sounds fine, said the teacher, but one of you is barking, just like a seal. Is it you, Joey? said the teacher. No said Joey. Is it you, Helen? said the teacher. No, said Helen. Is it you, 
Dorothy, Robert, Fred, Joanne, or Agnes? No, said the children. Then it must be you, said the teacher. I am sorry. The school is just for boys and girls. Please let me stay, said Sammy. I will be good. All right, you may stay, said the teacher. Sammy was happy. He sat at his desk and looked at the teacher. He learned how to read. He learned how to write. And now it is time to play," said the teacher. "Who wants to play a game? We do," said the children. They threw a ball over the net. The ball must not hit the ground," cried Sammy's team. "Somebody catch the ball." Sammy caught the ball on his nose. The boy on the other team tried to catch the ball on his nose too. Boys must must catch with their hands," said the teacher. Sammy tried to catch the ball with his flippers. Seals must catch with their nose," said the teacher. Up and down went the ball, from one side to the other. At last, the teacher blew her whistle. "Who wins?" said the teacher. "It is even," said the teacher. Everybody was happy. A bell rang. School was over. "Will you be here tomorrow?" said the children. "No," said Sammy. "School is fun." But I belong in the zoo. I just wanted to know what it's like outside. Now I have to go back. Goodbye, Sammy," said the children. "We will come and see you." Good," said Sammy. Sammy was in a hurry to get back to the zoo. He had so much to tell the other seals. "May I welcome you home, Sammy?" said Mister Johnson. I am glad you are back. You are just in time for dinner. There's no place like home," said Sammy. "The end." I hope you enjoy this I can read book called Sammy the Seal. If you like this book, you can also check out the book Danny and the Dinosaur, also by Sid Hoff, that I have read. I hope you enjoy the adventure that Sammy the seal goes on to outside, where he finds lots of incredible things. Now, be sure to hit that like and subscribe button, and I will see you next 